Yeah, hello guys, it's Patrick HDX Gaming here and welcome to episode 8 of my iPlay You Learn series. This time I will focus a bit more on game opening passes and you will also see how to finish off an attack safely. So yeah, I've got two examples for you. The first one is a game opening pass with a lock pass, which you can do with pressing the triangle button when you are holding L1 on the PS3 and if you are on the Xbox you have to press the Y button while holding LB. And then the second example is a simple low pass, which you can do with pressing the triangle button on the PS3 and the Y button on the Xbox. Let's begin with the first example. Here I played the ball to Koreshma who did a quick back heel to Ronaldo and then I played the game opening pass with Ronaldo into the run of Karashma. Karashma is one on one against the goalkeeper and then I played him out and scored with an easy finish. Let's get into it. Here is the key situation guys. When I played the ball to Karashma, he did a quick back heel and this led to an awesome situation for me. Right after he did the back heel, he started his offensive run. Just by the way, you can also press L1 when you got the ball to make your teammate running into the free space. That's also what I'm doing here. On the Xbox it would be LB. So yeah, and he starts his run into a big gap here because those two defenders here are focused too much on Ronaldo. Ronaldo got the ball now and I waited a bit so that Quaresma can make more space and when he's nearly at the offside line I played a high lob ball to him as I explained at the beginning. Now he's alone and has only the keeper to beat. And so I run straight forward to the keeper and let's say about 3 meters in front of him I flicked the right stick a bit sideways to him and Koreshma pushed the ball forward and I was through. And the finish was very easy then. Here I can only recommend you to watch these two tutorials here if you haven't already. The first one is about fancy passing which shows you how you can do a back heel pass for example and the second one is about pushing the ball forward. These two tutorials will help you out. Just click the screen to open the tutorials in a new window and you can watch them after this one here. So guys, this was situation number one. Let's move to the second example. Here I got the ball while I'm on a counter attack and played it to Cleverly who did an awesome, very awesome game opening pass to Valencia. Valencia quickly played it into Nani and Nani also does and Rudy heads it in and we've got an awesome one touch counter attack at the end. So yeah, the pass is also the key situation here. When Cleverly got the ball I saw that Valencia was making space on the right wing and also this big free room here. Then I played it to him when he was in the right situation and instead of running directly to a goal with him I decided to also play it quickly to Nani. Before Nani even touched the ball I saw that my teammate Rooney here was so alone which is deadly. So I also decided to play it quickly with Nani. This time with a normal cross and Rooney was indeed free in front of the goal. But it's not over guys, if you want to make sure to score do always finish against the movement of the keeper as I'm always saying. He comes from the near post and so I also finish at the near post. Very easy and so effective guys. And here you can also watch two tutorials if you haven't already to improve yourself. The first one is the crossing tutorial where I show you the different types of crosses and the second one is the finishing tutorial where I show you effective tricks to get the ball into the goal a lot easier. Just click the screen to get there. And I personally think it's good to link you with the tutorials so you can decide yourself if you want to watch it or not. With over 150 videos on my channel it can be hard to find something for the newer subs among of you. If you don't want to see the tutorials I link just don't click on them and everything is good. It's just a help for you guys. So yeah that's all I have to say. I hope you learned something and yeah thanks for watching this. Please make sure to give this a like and comment about what you think and if you want more in the future please subscribe to me. See you next time guys. Peace.